But one delicate operation remained before the thousands of tons of steel became self-supporting. The arch had to be closed or joined. Major arch bridges of the past required complicated jacking operations to push both huge sides of the arch far enough apart to place the last link. This operation was greatly simplified at New River by constructing the ends of the arch arms slightly too high. Then with the final member in position, both arms were simply lowered and final connections made to create a true self-supporting arch, the greatest ever.